Hello everybody and thank you for checking in. Welcome back to the free to play extravaganza. Looks like your junk ship has We're looking at Galactic Junk League. Use the wazzy keys and the mouse to move around. A little bit of a tutorial. Okay, so the first thing for me is that I'm not much of like into builder games. Well done. Now place that thruster in I like that he's, you know, telling me what to do because I wouldn't know otherwise. That is my first thumbs up, I guess. Uh Perfect. Notice that your movement No, I didn't notice. Gyroscope. Thank goodness for highlighted area. Okay. Um. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna get into training. Just debris flying everywhere. Oh, I see. I have to be lined up right. Or it'll just shoot with one. <laughs> really? Is the second one further? <laughs> it's kind of obvious. Press one to go faster. That helps. Yeah, so basically shoot. All right. I bet the center would be more effective, but it's kind of neat shooting around the edges, like the stuff blows everywhere. This is pretty interesting. Alright, so I'm not much into building, so I'm pretty much going to leave it at what the tutorial got me to. Oh, research. Alrighty, Junker. Welcome back. With the junk you've earned, you can research a new block. Rocket launcher. Okay. Now I recommend researching a rocket launcher. Okay. Now that you've researched the block, you can find it in your block inventory. And you can access the block inventory and use it on any ship whenever you want. Okay. Great! You passed basic junk training. Congratulations! Now all that's left is go build more ships, fight in matches in the arena to win some junk, or you can go practice some more in single player mode. Yeah. So I'm just gonna practice and this is gonna be edited up. I'm gonna mute for now and it'll be a voiceover. I really like the music. It's very good music. I know that people who are into, you know, having to build something and then this arena type style would really, really love this. It's actually pretty surprising to be free because I see a lot of potential already. It looks like you, I didn't really get into the building part much, but it looks like you have a lot of options. Uh, on the Steam page, which I will have linked below, you can see, um, let me look at it, <laughs> see if I'm remembering right. Yeah, even just the screenshots on there, you can see people make some interesting ships. But basically, it's build anything, fight anyone in space 
What used to be a prosperous universe is now a post-apocalyptic rusty dump full of galactic junk. Savage arenas become the only amusement we have. To fight and destroy, we use all necessary means from super advanced beam weapons to make shift torpedoes. That's a little description on Steam, just so you know. And this was a January release, so it's still fairly new. And it is in early access currently. And it is free to play. I don't know if it's going to stay that way. So that's one reason I really wanted to make a video and get this out to you guys. I don't know if this is going to cost money when it comes out of early access. And it's pretty cool. Like, it's supposed to have some cross-platform multiplayer. Um, it definitely has, you know, online multiplayer. You can play with other people. It's not exactly up my alley um, per se, but I know that it is something a lot of people would enjoy and it's got pretty positive reviews. So people are definitely enjoying it. And just in case any of my viewers would, I just wanted to put this out there and make sure you know about it and show you a little bit. So I hope you like this video. Be sure to Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Be sure to get Galactic Junk League for yourself if it's something you think you'll enjoy. And let me know down in the comments below if you have played this yet, what you think of it, and any feedback about this episode of the free-to-play extravaganza and me kind of like bringing it back. Um, you know, one thing is that I do want to focus on Steam games now. When I when this series was a little more active, I was covering Windows Store games, and now I want to cover Steam games, and I hate to say this, but decent free-to-play Steam games are kind of few and far between, but I think this is a good one. What do you think? Let me know, and I will see you next time.